Although it's been quiet in the halls since March, the clinical program at the University of the District of Columbia, David A. Clark School of Law, has continued its mission to serve D.C. residents who could not otherwise afford representation. Here are some highlights from 2020. My name is Nina Ego Swala, and I'm a 3L at UDC Law. Hi, my name is Ali Macedo, and I'm a 3L at UDC Law. One major part of my UDC Law career was being a student in the Immigration and Human Rights Clinic. In spring 2020, we went to the border, Tijuana, Mexico, to assist asylum seekers with declaration drafting, completing asylum applications, and preparing for hearings. This gave us the opportunity to better our legal writing, client communication, and advocacy skills. As a first-generation Nigerian-American, it was an honor to be able to help those who are underserved and underprivileged. When I tell you that this was one of the most impactful experiences of my life, that is no exaggeration. I mean both personally and professionally. I saw everything that we had been taught in a classroom. I heard stories that our clients had told us become a reality. My colleagues and I got to work hands-on advocating for migrants in the trenches. We heard stories from migrants who were traveling from the Northern Triangle in Central America all the way to Mexico, to the border town of Tijuana, trying to seek asylum. It was also very fulfilling to be someone that they can confide in, someone who would listen to them, and someone who gave them confidence to go before an immigration judge and plead their case. Many of them have very strong cases. Many of them are just fighting for a better life. And it was, it was amazing to be there with them and to be a part of their fight. We got to advocate in a way that I have never been exposed to before and it was the most impactful experience for, of my legal career. Our work may look a little different during the pandemic, but students and faculty in the UDC Law Clinical Program are still practicing law, promoting justice, and changing lives.